paper. Take a look at it. But if you want to start a business... Oh, my... What's up, guys? Politics Gaming here, and today I'm going to do episode 5 of uh, the Russian Federation. Last time we did a lot of economic stimulus and today we're going to continue doing that while also watching the situation with Georgia. Georgia in the last episode threatened to um, take military action against my troops stationed in Dzao and um, Azbizka. I would say that name. Um, I am prepared to take military action. What I am going to do immediately is that I am going to to deploy um mil combat ready units to several bases. There we go. I'm going to deploy 10,000 people to that. I am going to reinforce the Gudauta uh, airbase. And um, I am going to move 3,000 troops from. Azerbaijan to Dizal. Um, and then second off, we are going to... What do we want to do? I want to privatize something because we need money. Naval transportation... We can keep that. Internet services, we can keep that. Banks. Traction parks. Advertising. Hmm. I don't think. Let's go ahead and subsidize advertising. Put about 30 million, 35 million dollars into that. Um. Let's put more people into fast food. They took this on a right fast food. Which we are th threatening. We've just been informed that Uh oh, looks like it was the Georgians. Um Actually Let's uh oh, there was another nuclear accident in Ukraine. Looks like they just don't learn. Ooh, it hit one of the cities. 240,000 refugees. Um, what do we want to do to reduce that? Income tax. Let's put that up. Seven. Let's cancel that. Um. We're just gonna go ahead and create a tax. Tax on financial transaction. While at the same time we continue to wait for a reaction from Georgia. Oh, we have second round of uh, elections. Good evening. The time has come. The preliminary results are in, and we can now reveal the second round results. G rip. Obviously, we are going to take majority. 
last one was 54%. We got 50, 60, 62%. Next time we're going to have to campaign a little harder. And there's Chechnya. Turn out of 62%. The theory that says if E1 doesn't like E2 no. and E2... Who is the President of the United States? Paul Ryan. Let's go ahead and move this satellite to Georgia. Let us also check. Sweet. So we expanded our um, Majority. And let us also commit what? Let's put some nuclear submarines there. And then let's also Deploy some cruisers because we're when if they attack, we're gonna want to want a uh, immediate reaction. Oh, we have an aircraft carrier. Let's go ahead and move that aircraft carrier down there, and let's move another set of cruisers. Ukrainian troop movements on our borders. Face with this threat, I can, with your agreement. No, I'll go ahead and do it myself. Where is the threat? Looks like they faced it. Let's. No, 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 they're moving troops away. Okay. Our navy is ready to commit strikes against uh, Georgia, just in case they attack. Iran, no. Let's go ahead and move that out uh, to Blissey. We will immediately take the matter to the UN Security Council. The International Committee will make you understand. The bill. Are they gonna vote for sanctions on me? Dang, I was hoping for a for a war. The preparations are complete. The whole. Yeah, let's go ahead and attend the Christmas festival. Well, I mean that's like a day late. Turkey. The theory. Yeah, let's go ahead and meet with them. Then we can like plan an assassination on uh, Erdogan. Let's go ahead and check on our economy. If it gets over three percent, we're gonna have to commit to austerity. Ooh. No incriminating evidence, but we do have the attempt to kill them. Hmm. Do we want to? Let's wait. I need. I'm gonna. Since I have a mole in there, I can fund one of their political parties. That's more appropriate to me. And then I can fund them, and then I can kill the president, there will be an election. And then... Good morning. Your armed forces, and it's better that they quit as soon as possible. Great, you already did that, you're taking it to the UN. 
Here are the GDP. Sweet. We're still working on our housing situation. Come on, Georgia, what are you up to? Nothing in report Ukraine. Nothing has happened in the last five days. Ooh, hell yeah. Uh oh, riot. Yeah, there's a riot. The city is in a quasi civil war situation. According to our correspondent, who's on location, confrontations began after a police operation to find weapons and drugs had been carried out in a poor neighborhood. The population is not happy about this raid, deemed violent and stigmatizing, and many think that the government totally abandons their neighborhoods. The most violent protesters have arrived downtown and are battling with law enforcement. Yeah, we probably do ignore them. Sort of city. What do we got? We barely have any troops there. We don't have enough police. Let's move these guys out. And then move them back. Meeting requests. Kazakhstan. Yeah, let's meet with y'all. Meet with you. Drop to 11%, so we're doing good on unemployment. Okay, we got it. We have subdued. Nice. Let's kind of just antagonize the Georgians. Move our ships near their sea borders. Good morning. Good morning. Sales milk. No. Our agents. Yeah, let's go ahead and dismantle them. Yeah, yeah, you already did that. I'm not moving my troops, Georgia. Shut up. Let's do a few airstrikes while we wait. See what happens whenever we do this. Oh, well, Georgians didn't even react. So 
Pending resolutions, consult the optical resolutions. Deficit requires attention. What are you at? 280. That's down from 288. 2.88. Alright, so what we are going to do... I'm gonna get spotted. I'm gonna go ahead and pay a little more attention to our economy. We want... Maze. It's kind of like, put you at 2% customs. Bad strategy. The thing. Yeah, let's go ahead and dismantle that. Our agents. The terrorist. Or As I predict. So uh, we're going to go in and off here. Um, if you like this video, go ahead and like it, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys next time. Alright, take care guys.